What's going on there, everyone? So I got these mojo things last year called Flicka Flockas. They're actually pretty cool. Six of them come in a pack. They're about $85 at your local Mills Fleet Farm. Well, Fleet Farm now because they dropped the Mills. But, uh, yeah, they're pretty cool. You just hit, put a battery in it, hit the button, it'll turn on, spin for five seconds. So if you can see that. Go here again in a second, I think. Yeah, it just sits there. It just does it constantly. Now, another cool thing about it is I also got these Lucky Duck. Call them little pucks. They come gray, but I painted them. And they do the same thing. Just a Rippler. Two AA batteries. It's a little weight inside that makes it go around. I painted mine uh, brown because I didn't like the gray color in the water. But yeah, it just sits in the water and makes ripples in the water. It's great to attract ducks from long ways away, I suppose. Only used it a couple times last year. Lost one of my Mojo Flicka Flockas out on White Lake if uh, anyone come across it. It's mine. But no, uh, yeah, I got these Mojos and then I got uh, the old Mojo Duck Jr. here. It's a smaller version of the two. Turn around, wing spin. I only used that a couple times last year too. And I can't believe how heavy this thing is. To sit on a three foot pole stuck in the mud. I actually took that pole, threw it away, got like a six foot piece of PVC pipe, and painted that green and put that in there. It seems to work a lot more. Three foot pole and that thing's heavy. Now, these other ones I got from Lucky Duck. These ones are much lighter and they're a little bit bigger. The camera can pick that up. These are a little bit bigger. And uh, the mojo I got. That's like $120 for the one. Now these ones, the mojo plugs into the wall, charge a battery. These ones got four AA batteries in there. And it comes with an extra battery pack. You just switch them out if you run out. But these were $120. Not for one, like the mojo, but two. Got the Drake and the Hen for the same price as the mojo and they're lighter. Now the pole they got is the same pole as what the Mojo has, but those ones stand up a little bit better. And I didn't have to get a piece of PVC pipe for it to get it to go. So, if you're into uh, them kind of decoys, I'd get the Lucky Ducks over the Mojo, but I already had the Mojo before. I got the Lucky Ducks, so that's why I got three of them now. Hardly ever used three of them ever probably one but I use these flicker blockers every time and I put these in with the feeding with my feeding decoys because it makes no sense to put them in 12 feet of water or you know further out in your spread if the ducks can't eat there so that was my two cents let me know what you guys think and catch you next time